Ahoy, fellows! Now that those darn Yankees are out of the way, I suppose it's time to actually figure out what the heck's going on with the uh, Tachibana real estate people. I can run faster! I have to hold the A button. Okay, well that was quick. What are my abilities again? <laughs> Maybe I might want to put some money into beast mode if I'm going to just start out in beast mode. I thought I did last time, but I guess I didn't. That was in the uh, the timeline that got erased. <laughs> Alright, you know what? I'm just going to beat him up in Brawler or whatever. Just because it's more fun that way. Yep. Boy. Haha, <laughs> got him. Okay, no. These guys are getting better at what they do, but, like, not by much. There we go. You know what? Don't make me. Okay, hold up. Actually, don't make me die. <laughs> that would suck a lot. Let me just, uh. I gotta say, using an item for a street fight feels kind of sad, but... There we go. It's not like my health um, goes back up after the street fight anyways, so whatever. Sheesh. Anyways. Well, darn. <laughs> this is where I'm going to end up. But apparently I can't just come here immediately. That sucks. Oh, I can just come here immediately. <laughs> <laughs> nice! It's pretty clear what I want. Time to pay your protection money, pal. Right, what the heck with that? You didn't... Yeah, you didn't even actually protect me. Well, what are you talking about? You had Tachibana Real Estate. They chased me out. Oh, jeez. Tachibana Real Estate chased you out? <laughs> Scott, who do you think... Anyways, I gotta relocate. What the heck? I better keep that attitude in check. I'm a, I'm a civilian, actually. Just, uh, just a kind, strong civilian. <laughs> Where's the, where'd Tachibana real estate push you out of? Um, I mean, I'm not exactly trying to just swoop in, I'm, you know. Okay. Uh, don't worry, I'll beat you up. I'll, I'll beat some sense into you, boyo. Okay. There we go. I gotta remember to bob and weave more often, you know? Hey! <laughs> hey! There we go, of course. The head stomping will continue until more hour improves. Pow, how did you even hit me through the. Uh... Okay, there we go. We did it, guys! We beat a guy up. Perfect. Yeah, don't try it again. Well, you just lost to some kid, actually. <laughs> Get out of here. Get lost, pal. I don't know, it looks pretty over to me. Unless you're gonna, like, bring 20 guys back or something. Now we can finally talk in peace. Yep. I'm absolutely gonna take your place. Oh, okay, never mind. I'm not even young, so I just gotta know where Tachibana Real Estate is located, so that I can, you know, figure out what the heck's up with them. You know? <laughs> yeah, they knew everything about me, too. Oh, jeez. Well, to top it all off, they're not even Yakuza. <laughs> I don't even know what to expect with them. Well, yeah. Anyways. Still where? Where are they? A Hakwa building on Shichifuku Street. Shichi, oh jeez, that's a, uh, uh, Shichi, seven clothes, yeah, yeah, definitely a direct translation, anyways, there's one stubborn guy who said the only way he was leaving us in a casket, they're probably gonna be bringing a casket out by the time I come out, that's great, I can make a, I can make a, uh, I can make a coffin dance me, that's gonna be great. <laughs> Anyways, finally, 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 I can get to where I need to be. Just, uh, Chichifuku Street. You know, the Hakwa building. 
Oh, I run out of stamina. That's pretty funny. I, I didn't actually see that coming. I can jog forever, but I run out of stamina. Oh yeah, actually it's 9 <laughs> Shit. What a fun thing to just notice right now and nonchalantly mention. Time of recording, it is currently September 11th. So, you know, everybody join me in a moment of silence. Thousands of people who lost their lives in a terrorist attack on September 11th, 2001, if you would. Though I suppose it is now almost an entire week later on September 16th when this video is actually going up. Anyways, sup you bums? What'd you get kicked out by the real estate company or something? I'm gonna I'm gonna do my darndest to not make a um, terrible joke. <laughs> I was born in 2003, um, and even if I was born in like '99, I don't know if it would have the same kind of effect on me. And I don't know. There's some wacky stuff. They're the last holdout in the Namaste Bar. I suppose I'm going to the bar, fellas. That's right. We're singing Dami Dami again. Bakamitai, who knows it? Come on, everybody, together now. Dabe dabe, dabe o, dabe dabe, oh, oh. Yeah, I don't know the, don't know the words actually. How's he? How do you, fella? So, time's this place open. He goes, It ain't open no more, pal. I gave up. Are they closed? No, I guess not. <laughs> Who are you? We're not open yet. Oh, aren't you? I just uh, want to ask you a couple things. You work here? I run the place. No, I am not with the Jinsei family. The who? No, you're not. <laughs> he says, hold on now. I could still beat you up even worse. I just want to talk to you. I just want to talk to him. I just want to talk to him. Does it matter who I am, pal? I'm asking you a question, and I'm big enough to make you regret not answering. So... <laughs> oh, jeez, Tojo plan. Well... That makes sense. Tachibana guys sent him running. Well, then I guess I wouldn't be one of them, huh? Of course they'd flinch against civilians, they're the only people they can't just completely mortar, you know? <sighs> Sheesh. Yeah, Tachibata will say, just drop in one day out of nowhere, announce that they own the building. They all had to leave. You're getting evicted, huh? That sucks. Oh well. I'm the last holdout. This is what middle-aged men look like? He looks pretty good for middle-aged. And again, I, I don't actually know. You don't, you don't really interact with people that are actually middle-aged all that often. I find... Well, I don't know. There's a, there's a wacky kind of, like, a uh, couple decade gap between people that live in certain areas. Like when you're a child, at least where I grew up, you grow up around children and their parents, and then maybe old people. You know? But then, when you get to be like 20, you hang around people in college that you've never seen before, and like people in their 40s or 50s that you ain't never seen before, you know? I guess you see people in their 40s. I don't know, I'm probably just talking about myself here. <laughs> my parents had at least my older siblings when they were pretty young. So I remember like my dad's 40th birthday and all that. But he's like 50 something now. So I know people in their middle ages. And I guess they don't look all that different from when they were like 40. There's definitely a change, but it's not like I'm gonna, uh, I don't know, lose all your hair immediately kind of thing. Even my grandparents haven't lost all their hair yet, so... 
That's maybe much later, at least in my family. Only male pattern baldness we have is our shins, apparently, according to, um, I don't know, genetics. My dad swears it's because he wore long socks for baseball, but I think I know better. <laughs> Seeing as he hasn't worn long socks for baseball in a long time. I'm not Yakuza, just a civilian. Um, you can think of me as a bodyguard, though. Which means that I'm gonna beat the crap out of you. From scum like you. Called Tachibana Real Estate. Alright, well. Doesn't matter much what an outsider like you has to say. I'm here for my money. Came bearing gifts. Oh, I see. So he's, what, is he refunding the protection money since they're not protecting anybody? How honorable. Because yeah, that says the protection money you paid him to date. Three years worth of 30 grand a month? Wow. These people are quite honorable, I gotta say. It's interesting that the Yakuza is doing a nicer business than... Oh, wait, never mind. This is not a Yakuza guy. I see. Eh. Plus another two million is a gift from our president. Oh, are these Tachibana real estate guys? Here's two million more! <laughs> Milk money for the baby. Oh, jeez, he's a Tachibana real estate girl. What are you saying, Namase-san? Let's call it a deal. We expect your departure in the next few days. Oh. Ain't about the money, pal. It's an attitude. Think you can roll in with your one-sided demands and muck around with those little people's lives however you like? And the guy in the suit that is taller than everybody else here, he says, Yes, I do. For all the tantrums you like, this is all you're getting. I don't know, pal, that's like six million bucks. I don't know if, like, all you're getting is really the thing to say there. It looked like more in the stacks. If it isn't the money, what is it? <laughs> I like this bar. I like being here, pal. <laughs> Time to beat up some real estate agents. See? That guy in the front, he looks like a real real estate agent. Everybody else does not look like a real estate agent. Oh, cash in the father's face in front of us. Get it. Is that how Tachibana does business, huh? Well, yeah. Why do you say that? Mm -hmm. I'll give you an ethics lecture. With my fists! Huh? Well... Is he gonna take your money anyways? May as well. I mean, come in. Especially if it's a gift. In that instance, since it's not contractual, you can kind of just take it and not actually concede demands. Now, they would get really pissed off if you did that. But they're also not, like actually making any demands for it back at this time, so... Hey now, my fetishes are my own business, buddy. I'm really hoping that didn't cause the microphone to spaz out and make wacky noises again. <laughs> Was this his play all along? He said, they just keep coming here and giving me money. And if... <laughs> <laughs> That's actually it's a major play. A little patience and look at the returns. <laughs> oh boy. I see. I mean, hey, I I can't I can't blame them, man. That's a it's a pretty good little not even a scam he's running. He's just cashing in. And <laughs> Cashing in. I was hey you. Who the heck are you? Where'd all your other buddies go? He goes, touch him on a real estate, dragged him off to the river. Told us this one's all done. Huh? Oh, wait. <laughs> Who knows? There's lots around. Tachimana-san's got his fingers in all sorts of pies. 
So they hire homeless people to stand around buildings. Ooh, wow. I don't know why you're asking, but you shouldn't mess with them guys. Very shadows of this town. Dang, man. They've got it all figured out. Real estate, buddy. I don't think I'll ever really understand the whole American dream buy a house kind of thing. Like, I want to own a house. Or whatever. But, God, my stepmom was, like, talking to my dad about this at one point. And she was like, wouldn't that be great to just buy another house? I'm like, you already have a house. <laughs> and then you would, what, buy another one just so you can not even live in it half the time and pay the same, like, more in property taxes and all that jazz? <laughs> Sounds like a stupid idea, you know? I can understand, like, renting it out, but... That wasn't even what they were talking about. It's like, just buy a house somewhere, right? What a dream. Buy a house somewhere near, like, a beach, because my stepmom just loves water, right? And let it sit there and collect dust until you decide you want to go to the beach for, like, a weekend or something. <laughs> like, that doesn't seem like a very... A financial invest, a good financial investment, you know. <laughs> if you're gonna do that, you're gonna sink all the money on that. You could buy a freaking apartment complex. I don't know. Buy a buy a condo by the beach, you know. Rent out everything, and keep the president sweet to yourself, <laughs> something like that. Eesh. Find the homeless man. You got it. Now you know what that means, fellas. On the next episode of Yakuza 0, I'm going to be searching for homeless men. Till then, you know what? I'm going to find another group of guys that want to beat me up to beat up. And then I'm going to end the episode just because, oh. Eh, you know what? I'm not going to get into that just yet. I did walk by that couple one time on off camera and uh, I'm just not going to talk to them again. Mm hmm Here we are. Bunch of suckers. Men in black? Yeah, okay, pal. You're gonna be men in black and blue in just a little bit. Yep. Wah! ka -chow. Oh, dang, I didn't... ka -chow. Nice one, pal. Taste my flying kick. Taste my knee! Okay, dang it. I didn't get to use the, the epic flying knee kick. I guess it was just a flying knee. Anyways, that's a darn shame. This sucks. What the heck is this? Okay, I'm just not going to worry about that, actually. Park Audi. Okay, um, how about I run? Because I just want to save the game. I won't let you off next time. I just leave the alley and they leave me alone. That's pretty cool. Oh, and there's... Okay, no, I'm going to save at this point, right? God, they really... They just got boys everywhere. They got fellas all over the place. Oh, what the heck? Hey! It's the, it's the, it's the, uh, it's the, 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 it's, uh, it's, uh, the, 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 uh, the, the, yeah, yeah, it's Kamoji. The guy that trains the Rush style. You know, this seems like a wonderful place to ask people to throw punches at you. Do you have parking garages that look like this? Wow. Ah, punch out artist, was it? That's right, that's me, it's my job. <laughs> what do you do? Well, you knock me down or knock me out, and the prize money's yours. Double stakes. Customer puts up ten, I I give them twenty if they win. Half of that's the front up fee, and so we only need to fork over the other half, yeah. Okay. Time limit sixty seconds. You hit the challenger. If you hit the challenger, you also lose. The what? Oh I see. 
So I have to not get, like, punched out. That's your best bet. Come at you in a nice straight line, easy to dodge. Punchers are garbage, too. I advise to everyone I see this. Well, hey. I might, uh... Hmm. Why would I want to be your apprentice? Well, nobody's ever took me down before. Words getting around. I get much less uh, challengers. So, you know, that's not great for business. If I get into some new blood that'll actually, you know, get their teeth kicked in every now and again, people would actually pay me money for this garbage. It's kind of high. If I have any pointers to give you, I'm sure to let you know. I make a pretty good teacher. Well, hey. Sure, why not? I just uh, want to get to the payphone. Oh, wow. <laughs> Some of these are pretty pricey. <laughs> Plenty of people rolling in cash around here, so I figured I might get lucky. One guy picked a million yen course. Well, uh, maybe. That's why I turned down the million yen guy. He looked a bit too tough to risk it. <laughs> why even have the courses? <laughs> Tracks challengers. No way a homeless guy like me. Uh, pay out. Anyways. Box had a plan. Starts out by looking for a 10,000 mark. And uh, then we do the 100,000 mark, you know. <laughs> oh boy. No way anyone will take you up on a bet that high. Don't knock till you try it though, yeah, I guess. You, of course. You pay out the prize money. Okay. Oh, that's the end of the sub story. <laughs> the beginning and end of the sub story, and it was unskippable. I could not have avoided that since I came down this alley. Anyways, whatever. I don't care. I'm saving the game. And maybe, just maybe, after I see those homeless men in the next episode, I'll train my rush style. Since that's a super rad fighting style. Till then, like, comment, and subscribe. Or I'll kick your teeth in. <laughs> Goodbye! Yeah, I hope that one. I thought it was pretty funny.